Hey guys, welcome to Grano 2 here, and I am doing a deck profile on a uh, Beast Warrior Pendulum deck, and it's actually really fun, and I bet it's a telenauts with it, so it's got the potential. It's just, mm. Story is actually, I was bored one night, and I'm just thinking, what would be fun, because I thought of it. Fire formations with beast warriors without fire fists, and this is what it came up. Then yesterday, I thought, what about if I put the pendulums that nobody thinks are good about the normal monsters in? This deck's actually crazy good. So, start off, play three Jenny Rapid Werewolf, 2000 attack. Uh, this werewolf has given inactivable strength due to. Her through horrific gen <laughs> its gentle nature was completely wiped out and now lives only to unleash destruction. And then you got three gladi gladiator beast Andal. This one eyed beast warrior is aggressive hunter that strikes down its prey with the powerful swipes of, a claw of its claws. No one can bear the burn of his tremendously fast and heavy blows. Oh, I get that because he's a bear. No one can bear. That's not good. That was bad, Konami. Then three Vorse Fight Raider because nostalgia and it's cool. And yeah, this wicked beast. Well, this wicked beast, uh, beast warrior does everything horrid, every horrid thing imaginable, and loves it. He acts, bears the marks of his countless victims. So he rapes everyone. Um. That's not really that good. But then, never mind, because we play all these vanillas. Play the rabbit. I've seen, I see this card a lot. <laughs> like, a lot. But yeah. Next, the pendulums. Three dragon horn hunter. All normal monsters gain 200 attack, and you can take no battle damage from battles involving normal monsters. So, mmm, that's nice. And then you got. The Lance for Flyfinus, I actually said that right. Lance Lance for High Hynicious. Lance for Hynicious. That's actually uh, not that hard to say, people. If a uh, normal monster you control attacks a defense position monster by inflicting battle, dim da battle damage to your opponent. No. It, you inflict piercing damage. I have been terrible today. So, yep. Yeah, um, 16 monsters in total. Then we play. Then I play. Two Dark Factory of Mass Productions, because, yeah, um, I've been dealing anti meta man, and one of the cards I've just been using for his frogs, uh, what's it called? The Inferno Reckless thingy. Uh, <laughs> I'll just check that actually. Inferno Reckless Summon is actually really bad for him against his deck. Who cares about, um, getting all the. Uh, the frog lock, the dupe frog lock, I think. I get three werewolves, so yeah. Next one, dark hole, because when you write geeky format, two four station bar bargain. Send one special summon monster on either side of the field to the graveyard, and special one level four or lower normal monster from your hand. This card gets over nearly everything. It's like, wow. It's crazy. Triple Tenki, search all your monsters, and they gain 100 attack boost. Double Tensu, rank 4 plays. Double MST. Uh, what's it called? I forgot what the card was called, but the one that destroys all spells and chats when your opponent's monster attack. That card kills this deck. Show you why in a sec. One bottomless. Because it's bottomless, so I like it still. Now, two common charity. In other words, Lure of Darkness. Because draw two cards, remove from play one normal monster from your hand. I prefer this over the other normal monster where you have to tribute. Just because you still have your normal summon. Even though with Tensu, I still prefer common charity. Because. I can just say I play two of the Lure of Darkness instead of saying I tribute a monster to draw two. So, yeah. 
one Compulse, uh, two D Prison, two Tenson. This card is crazy. Like Summon Werewolf, it gets uh, activate this next turn. It's easily a three K beast. Dude. Yeah, two Soul Drain, Skill Drain. I mean, because uh, you can play it with ease. You have the crazy box in the extra deck if you want to go for rank four, and yeah. It kills nearly every deck. One warning. Because it's warning. One soul drain. Because it doesn't hurt this deck at all. Besides from maybe the rabbit. <laughs> it this If you get skill drain and soul drain. It's game. It can really do nothing. Unless they get BL. Oh, I'm not sure of BLS. But never mind. Um, yeah. Then the one Tari for the main deck. Which... Yeah. Next to the extra deck, one Abyss Dweller, because Yang Zings, Battle Fader, that's still things. Two Tiger Kings, because it's crazy in this deck. Two Castell, just can play two. Diamond Dyer, Cowboy, 101, Ragnar Zero, because I really like this card. Especially against the Dole Chase and all that. <laughs> I don't know. Black Ship. Rhapsody. So we are learned Draco. Really. I'll, if I can, I'll first turn this. That's a direct 4000 because you probably have a Tensor or Tanky on the field. So, yeah. One Crazy Box with the Skill Drain and one Roach because actually in this format, I've been, I thought you think about it. You got Shidoz and. It just kills your dolls because they can't go base fusions. Yeah. Yeah, thank you guys for watching. Tell me what you think. This deck has been shown to do well personally. And it is really fun. Just it's the funnest deck I have ever played personally. One of them. Neo Spaceans win all the time with that. But <laughs> yeah, thank you guys for watching. Leave your comments. Leave comments below and what you think. And yeah, Perry out. See you guys.